Hi, in this video I would like to show you some uh, stuff about the analog sensors. Uh, this uh, the motors need some uh, feedback, position feedback that it's on this uh, six headers there. For, that is three rows each. That's the signal the power at the ground. And uh, so you need to connect uh, uh, mechanically a potentiometer on the motor that it turns. It uh, follows the potentiometer position at this will give reference on the controller so to know the position of the motor it positioned correctly so um, for, uh, usually you can find uh, this uh, like there like uh, 10 10 ones they stop they have a stop but they are 10 about 10 times from its from side to side so this um, I don't know how, how long they can last how many times you can hear them you can hear them they have contacts inside you know it's most likely like 10,000 uh, rotations or 100,000 rotations uh, maybe so Anyway, these are pretty easy to to find. It's common. Um, another uh, one that uh, you can use instead of this uh, could be like a contactless uh, encoders. This one I found here. It's a non-contact one. Single turn. Actually, this one is has 110 degrees, 180 degrees rotation. And it's this sensor here. Now, I'll show it to you here. I have it already connected on the AMC. Okay. Now you'll see that this sensor doesn't have uh, head limits. It means that you can turn it, turn it, turn it. It uh, doesn't find head position like the other ones. Like for example, this one here. They have red. Now, for this one here, uh, this is 180 degrees. Like I said, this is by PI Technologies. So it has on the back like ground connected. plus 5 volt and the voltage out that goes to the sensor I use little hookups so you can show you all this in detail now uh, when uh, it has a little tab there in the middle I don't know if you can see it that's the stop position that's the middle position of the sensor so at this little slot there indicates that this is uh, the alignment so when you align it, the slot with the little tab there you have 50% rotation now what's useful about this is that you can have it do this rotation here 180 degrees exactly that's useful if you have a motor with a crank arm so you can have the arm extend up and down you put it like this so you can see it upper position, middle position, down ok, and if it goes over it it ignores the other position a little bit see that? And the same on top of it, it will ignore most of the top position, if you go over it too much it will pop up to the negative but that's not important, it has some safety limits there ok, so that's it. This is contactless. Let me take this out. Doesn't have any wear. I'm turning it. You don't hear anything compared to contactless. You can hear the the 
es esto tal de durable oh at the forgot to mention this has uh, 10 million rotation life so it'll last it's not expensive either actually those two are have this similar price i think these are about 12 15 dollars this is 15 all right all right thanks <coughs> thanks for watching